Basically, Blonde follows the central character, Elle Woods, who is a Malibu-born young woman who follows the man she loves to the East Coast, to Harvard, and that's really just the beginning. Elle Woods, to me, is very bright. If she was a color, she would obviously be pink. But I think a lot of people second-guess her, but throughout the entire course of the show, she's always trying to just keep pushing forward and just wanting to succeed and to thrive and keep it a positive. <laughs> Legally Blonde is what I would consider the perfect comedic contemporary musical. The score is very unique in that it blends a lot of different styles and genres, but it has this sort of unique ability to like create these motifs that belong to all of the characters throughout the show while still being youthful, contemporary Broadway sound. Delta News are really Elle's cheerleaders. We see them start at the beginning by encouraging her and helping her get into Harvard. I think we all have a different outlook of positivity that Elle uses. This story is very timeless and I think the message of be yourself and not have those societal expectations for yourself, that's a really important takeaway from the show and I'm really excited for people to get to watch that and watch a woman go through that journey. The set was designed to be like really small, compact, poppy elements that sort of tell us time, place, all of those important things, but are still sort of fun. Legally Blonde is going to be a great season opener, and if you have not made it up the hill yet to the West Side Campus in Danbury, Connecticut to see the work that we put on, you are definitely missing out.